we came out of the Gibraltar and since then on we are selling pretty well. Like we did a lot of short taking there and after that we had nice hill changes. I have to say everyone is getting pretty, very tired, <laughs> including me, but working super hard for it. Also because like there's so much water going on that you know you kind of stay wet. So it's not easy at all, but like we're fighting for it and now we're like we are coming we're still close to the first place. Unfortunately we're not making gains on them, but still close, so let's stay in the mix and well, you know, I think still three more days of sailing, maybe four. So that's, in the end, we're gonna attack for sure and we're gonna give it our best, eh? A little update on the last 24 hours, so uh, basically we finally Atlantic and been reaching down, uh, very nice conditions. Unfortunately we got stuck under some cloud, we lost like 10-15 miles to the competition. Uh, and now we're preparing for the night which uh, going to be like 35-40 knots downwind. We're thinking about splitting the fleet and maybe jibing earlier uh, down, the, down the coast uh, to see what the competition will be doing. So. That's about the plan of the uh, last 24 hours. Canary Island, 11 hour, the, the, the closest uh, boat uh, is following, following, following us. So. And about the, the crew, uh, Tom, Sam, Abby. The boat is very good. We've been able to to catch back to the watch system uh, uh, 36 hours ago because after the start we had plenty of uh, offshore life. <laughs> but no, no, very happy, uh, very happy with the speed of the boat. Very happy with the with the crew. Very happy of uh, where we are, even if it's not definitely not finished. There is still plenty to come, uh, it's, uh, it's quite a good start. <laughs> 